Good morning, guys. It's uh, Thursday, August 23rd. We're at the camp in Unity, New Hampshire, and for the next few days, we're going to be riding up through uh, Vermont and up to Lake Champlain, and from there, cut across upstate New York and go into uh, down the St. Lawrence River all the way down to where it meets up with Lake Ontario with a where those two waters come together. It's supposed to be a beautiful next few days. Um, the temperature this morning is great. It's in the high 60s, early 70s. It's no humidity. If it was like this the next few days, that would be perfect. So we're going to see some beautiful country and we'll um, hopefully get some good videos along the way. Camp for a couple of nights, probably one night on Champlain. There's a uh, state park up there, Grand Isle State Park on Hero Island, which is one of my favorite places in the world to camp. And then we'll find another place to camp over on the St. Lawrence, north of, um, north of Lake Ontario. I'm sure we'll find a place over there. Let's have a good ride, let's have a safe ride, and let's have a fun day. camping in Grand Isle State Park tonight in Vermont. It's uh, Grand Isle is a big island in the middle of Lake Champlain. Um, this park is one of my favorite places to camp. It's um, really pretty, got really pretty lakeside shore, very rocky but easy to walk on. They got, you know, a boat ramp, a dog beach, and they got a regular beach for people. It's a great place later on to go and sit down and have a drink and watch the dark come on. We're on the eastern shore, so you know you can't film a sunset, but it's okay. It's uh it's a beautiful spot. Tonight, actually late this afternoon, I'm uh, staying in Key Waden State Park in New York State. I rode all day today from uh, from Lake Champlain. Getting over here is really nice. Uh, this park, I actually, there's like five state parks within 20 miles of each other. that all have camping and I stopped at one and they laughed at me and said, you're not going to get in anywhere, everything's booked up. It's too busy here but the girl got on the phone and called all the other ones and found me this one campsite at this state park that they had left so that was pretty good it's actually a very nice park they have uh, a marina where people park their boats so they have walking paths to go around it they even have an olympic sized pool so we're going to camp here tonight um this park, I'm not quite sure if it's on Lake Ontario or on um, 
the St. Lawrence River that flows out of Lake Ontario. It's just outside of Alexandria Bay, which is like the northeasternmost point of the lake or the southernest part of the of the river. But tomorrow I'll go a little bit south and try and get some shots of Lake Ontario proper, just so, um, you know, I can say I made it there and we've got them. So I'm in St. Vincent, New York, a place called Tibbetts Point, which is right where the uh, St. Lawrence River um, meets up with Lake Ontario, which is behind me. It's really windy here. I hope you can hear me over the wind noise. This marks the point, too. It's always the sad part of a motorcycle trip for me, where I, I've gone as far as I'm going to go on this trip, and now is the time to turn around and head back home. But that's okay. We're going to go... Uh, we're going to head east across the Adirondack, and it should be a good day. The temperature is great this morning. It's like 68 degrees.